I know that the foam is what all the cool kids are doing and there's a lot of good things about the foam and I understand it in applications and we have done that and have used it. But in general, it, the, I can't find a mathematical difference in the R values and penetration between the foam and the blown in. But the blown in, it is less expensive, which is important even though I build a very kind of extravagant kind of home. Um, people don't get where they can afford these homes by wasting dollars. And so if there's not a real net gain in the use of the dollars, it's hard for me to recommend. And so the fact that the blown in is slightly less expensive is important. I, I feel like it has better sound qualities. Not everybody agrees with me on that. It is certainly friendlier to work with. And so the nature of my homeowners is we make a lot of changes. Homeowners walk in and say, well, it's this, but I wouldn't to add this here, whatever. You can do that with the blown in where you cannot do that with the foam because you compromise the foam and you won't effectively patch it. So it's just a friendlier product to work with from our standpoint.